गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द इंग्लिश क्लास इन दिस क्लास टूडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट ट्रांजिटिव एंड इन ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब इज अ वर्ब विच रिक्वायर्स एन ऑब्जेक्ट टू कंप्लीट इट्स सेंस इज कॉल्ड अ ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब एंड अ सेंटेंस विद अ ट्रांजिटिव वर्ब has a subject a verb and a direct object now let's understand it with few examples the first example is he eats bread he here is the subject eat here is the verb and bread here is the object now how do we know eat is a transitive or intransitive verb for that we need to find the direct object in the given sentence so when the subject and verb is followed by the question what or whom the verb will be transitive like what does he eat so in the first sentence uh the sentence here is he eats bread so what does he eat he eats bread that means bread here is the direct object it means eat here is the example of transitive verb the second example is she wrote a letter so what did she write she wrote a letter a letter here is the direct object and wrote here is the transitive verb in the third sentence ravi helped me ravi here is the subject and helped here is the example of transitive verb and me here is the object so whom did he help ravi helped me fourth is he made me laugh and fifth is ishi bought a new dress if the subject and verb is not followed by the question what or whom the verb will be intransitive now let's understand what is intransitive verb a verb which doesn't require an object to complete its sense is called an intransitive verb and a sentence with an intransitive verb only has a subject and a verb do remember no object now let's see the examples first sentence is i go i here is the subject and go here is the intransitive verb because there is no object second is he sleeps he here is the subject and sleep here is the intransitive verb third is the sun shines so shines here is the intransitive verb the fourth is the dog barks so barks here is also the example of intransitive verb now let's see few more examples of intransitive verb first is she is going to the market so she here is the subject is here is the helping verb and going here is the main verb which is intransitive verb now you must be wondering to the market here is not the object right because to the market here is a prepositional phrase second example is he is playing in the playground so he here is the subject is here is the helping verb playing here is the intransitive verb 
and in the playground here is again prepositional phrase now see the third one i write clearly so i here is the subject right here is the intransitive verb and clearly here is adverbial phrase fourth is he reads slowly he here is the subject reads here is the example of intransitive verb and slowly again here is the adverbial phrase prepositional or adverbial phrase are often used after an intransitive verb now let's read few more important points first is some verbs exist as intransitive verb only examples are go come sleep run sit die flow blow laugh sleep arrive smile fall etc second is most of the verbs can be both transitive or intransitive but the difference is if the verb is followed by the object it will be transitive verb and if the verb is not followed by the object it will be intransitive verb now let's see few more examples i eat so in this sentence i here is a subject eat here is the intransitive verb i eat rice so in this sentence rice here is the direct object that means eat here is the example of transitive verb second sentence he reads reads here is the example of intransitive verb and the other sentence is he reads a book so he here is a subject and reads here is the verb which is transitive verb and a book here is a direct object third is birds fly in the sky in the sky here in the sentence is prepositional phrase other sentence is he is flying so what is he flying he is flying a kite so in this sentence a kite here is the direct object and flying here is the example of intransitive verb a uh, sorry transitive verb now the fourth one the glass broke so in this sentence broke here is the example of intransitive verb and the other sentence is the child broke the glass so in this sentence the glass here is the direct object so broke here is the example of transitive verb now see the third one di transitive verbs can have two objects let's see the example he gave me a book so in this sentence he here is the subject and you can see here there are two object you can see it on the screen i have already written it me here is a indirect object and a book here is a direct object so what is our verb so this is give the verb here is the example of di transitive verb i hope you all understood transitive and intransitive verb so well thank you so much